Welcome back to the Red Carpet Reup, your go-to channel for all the latest in music industry drama and news. Today, we're diving into a legal chess game between Jay-Z and Dame Dash that's heating up as Rockefeller Records' assets are on the line. If you're into hip-hop history or just love a good business showdown, you'll want to stick around for this one. So let's start with the biggest headline. Jay-Z has made a strategic legal move to secure the future of his iconic debut album, Reasonable Doubt. According to documents recently uncovered by TMZ, Jay-Z's lawyers have notified the courts that when Rockefeller's ownership of the album's copyright ends in 2031, all rights will revert back to Jay-Z himself. This means that even though Dame Dash's shares of the company are up for grabs, whoever buys them won't have a long-term claim to Reasonable Doubt or its tracks. Now, here's where things get really interesting. Dame Dash, Jay-Z's former business partner, is being forced to auction off his 33.3% stake in Rockefeller to settle a $823,000 debt he owes to a movie producer. This auction is set for August 29th in New York City, and while it might seem like a golden opportunity, there's a catch. The buyer will only be a minority owner. They won't have any real power in the company since all decisions need a majority vote. Plus, with the expiration date on the master ownership looming, the clock is ticking on how much money they can actually make. Jay-Z and Kareem Biggs Burke aren't exactly thrilled about this auction. They've been trying to block the sale, arguing that the Rockefeller board, of which they're key members, needs to approve any sale of shares. But a judge recently ruled that Dame shares can be seized and auctioned off. Despite their objections, the judge even called out Jay-Z and Biggs for creating a no sell-off clause behind Dame's back in 2021. The only silver lining for them? They can participate in the auction and try to buy back those shares themselves. So what does this all mean? Essentially, Jay-Z is playing the long game. Even if someone buys Dame Dash's shares, they won't hold on to the rights to reasonable doubt for long. This move ensures that Jay-Z remains the ultimate gatekeeper of his legendary debut album. As for Dame, this auction is another chapter in the ongoing saga between him and his former partners, with a lot of money and history at stake. That's it for today's deep dive. If you found this breakdown helpful, make sure to hit that like button, share it with your friends, and of course, subscribe to the Red Carpet Reup for more exclusive content. See you in the next video.